Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing with you a laundry room makeover. It's more like a closet. It's not very big in here, but I want to make it look cute and functional. I do need to declutter and organize and hang some things on the wall to make it look cute in here. So I hope you'll stick around to the end to see the transformation and um, I hope I give you some inspiration to get some cleaning done in your house. So first up, I'm going to be taking everything out of this closet so that I can clean the shelf off and clean the walls in here. And then I will be cleaning off the washer and dryer. Um, it's always good if you're gonna redo a space, just take everything out that you can and just clean up so that you can see what you wanna do and get it organized. Alright, so this is how it's looking now that I've got everything cleaned out. Um, it's very dusty in here. I need to clean off this shelf. I'm going to be replacing this liner. Um, I'm going to vacuum and clean the walls in here and I'm going to put down a new shelf liner. Okay, so now I'm going to be putting some new shelf liner down. The only reason I'm using this particular design is because we already had this on hand. Um, we bought it for something else and ended up not using it. So um, I just wanted to put something down in case we had any spills with the laundry detergent or bleach. Um, and so that it just goes on this and not onto the shelf so I can wipe it down easily. I started out trying to cut this with scissors, but it was not working for me, so I found my husband's razor blade, and if you are working with the shelf liner, just know that it's so much easier to cut straight across if you have this tool. Now I'm going to be hanging up a sign in here. Um, just for some decoration. I found this laundry sign at the Dollar General. It was between five and eight dollars and on either side of the sign I'm going to be hanging up these small little wreaths that I found there last year. So I'm not sure that they still have these or not uh, but I believe they were five dollars each. This is how it's looking so far. I have gotten the shelf liner put down, these signs hung up and everything cleared out. I'm about to um, clean off these trim pieces and the shelf with some multi-purpose spray and the washer and dryer. And then I will start um, putting all of my laundry detergent, um, softener and things like that. I'm, I've gotten some glass um, canisters with lids and I'm going to be putting labels on them and restocking everything. And then I will put it all in here um, on the shelf.
Okay, moving on, I'm going to be stocking all of my laundry products in these clear containers. I bought most of this stuff at Walmart, um, and there are a couple of things that I got from Amazon, but I will have everything linked down below. about the lighting here but I wanted to show you that I found this um, clear container at Dollar General I believe it was five dollars or four dollars I'm not sure but um, I used this to put my dusters in and I ended up putting some gloves behind the dusters and then I got this white plastic container to put my mop pads in and it also came from Dollar General we can ride our own and in this time Okay, now it's time to put everything in the closet area on the shelf um, and see what it looks like. Um, I also bought a few decorations from Dollar General. I will show you those in just a minute. But um, there was a tray with handles. Um, I think it was $10. And then I got a plant. It was also $10. And then this little sign that I'm going to show you was $5. Okay, now it's time for me to show you the before and after. So this is the before, of course. It was very unorganized, junky, a bunch of things um, all over the place and just no decorations. And the after is very organized, clean and crisp looking with cute decor. Um, I really enjoyed doing this project. Um, I didn't spend a ton of money in here just because no one that comes over will ever see this simply because it's in a closet with doors closed most of the time, but I did want to make it look cute and functional and um, I really enjoy doing laundry in here now. So I hope you got a lot of inspiration and remember everything that I purchased will be linked down below except for the items that I got at Dollar General. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great rest of your day.